Apron on, shift mode on. Are you nervous? I'm nervous, I don't want to screw anything what? up. So, Wait. today we're gonna cook and taste this wonderful bevy of frozen, pre-cooked Spanish supermarket tapas. Yum. Yeah. And we're gonna be pairing it with bad supermarket wine. Will it all be disgusting or will some of it be good maybe? Who knows? And have we been food snobs for cooking our own tapas and ignoring what is just at our fingertips in the frozen section of the supermarket here in Madrid? Let's find out. Venga, let's go. Hey Spain lovers, so there's the James that you know, the James that's you know cooking from scratch, tapas recipes at home, that's going to great family run tapas bars and eating authentic quality tapas. But there's a James you don't know that I'm gonna tell you about. That there's a little devil on my shoulder, and that little devil, whenever I'm in the supermarket, is thinking, what are those frozen croquetas like? I never grew up in Spain. And so when you grow up in a place, you've always at some point tried some of this stuff, and I've never tried it. Well, you think you never tried it, but what do you think you get served in uh, bad Spanish stuff or stars? That's a good point. But I went to the supermarket and spent 30 euros. I keep doing this. And we're gonna cook this stuff quickly, then we're gonna jump back here and start tasting it. And I'm gonna finally satisfy that little devil sitting on my shoulder. Should we head to the kitchen? Let's go. Let's do it. <laughs> All right, apron on, chef mode on. Are you nervous? I'm nervous, I don't wanna screw anything what? up. So, wait. Anxiety, yeah, I don't. Where's the scissors? Ah, so. ah! Woo! Can't really breathe here Where anymore. are the tongs? So Yoli loves this crap. Whoa. My mom calls them libritos. Ah, I burnt these ones. They're really soggy. Uh, ah. Right. Ah. <laughs> ah. I burnt the jamón croquetas again. Again. Easy. Ah, I burnt the libritos. Ah. Ah. <laughs> this <laughs> pan is a disaster. Yeah. We're gonna start again, we've calmed down, we've cleared the smoke. I have a newfound respect for anybody who works in a professional kitchen, trying to balance a million things, because I have no idea. <laughs> Total control. Oh. Oh, yuck. <laughs> All right, feeling under control how these guys go. Ah, it's like the war zone in here. Come on at me. <laughs> Couldn't be a chef. Tortilla for table three. <laughs> The sound of silence, we've turned off the extractor. I hope you could hear that earlier action. <sighs> Extractor's going back on. Hope you can yeah. hear us. <laughs> Look! Getting... My eyes! Wow. Hey, we need two, three. Okay, I think this is bad. We don't get Woo! Alright, let's get back to the table. Let's eat! <laughs> what a spread. No. Ta da! <laughs> so After hungry. slaving away. It's lunch preparing. time too, so. Where do we start, Yoli? Uh, not with the churros. Not the churros. Great sumac wines. Actually, not too bad. Not Three too euros. bad. Not too bad. Yeah. Salute. Cheers to you. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers to you, Yoli. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers Let's see. Welcome to lunch. Bon appetit. Bon appetit. Okay, let's start. San Jacobos. Ugh. It's a very really, uh, flexible ham, right? It doesn't. Ah, oh, there you go, it broke. Shall I have the first? You, you have the first bite. This is your favorite. <laughs> out of 10. Give me a score out of 10. Wow. Yeah. Perfectly cooked, actually, by you. Oh. I mean, okay. You know, this is in the end like what? Um, boiled ham and cheese and breadcrumbs. It's well cooked. Mm -hmm. Not that bad. I would, I would maybe add a tiny touch of salt. Maybe E347, I would guess. All right, let's no. hit the croquetas. Um, croqueta jamón, ham. ham beach, ham croqueta. Yeah, okay. Going... <laughs> read about it, read about it. There's something kind of plasticky in there. It's not terrible. These are the expensive ones These as well. These are expensive, I can We have tell. cheaper croquetas. Yeah. It doesn't taste like homemade croquetas. No. It's a bit like the, 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 this guy, you know, this boy. Oh, it's on my face. It's on Yoli's face. It's on my face. <laughs> Can't see this. Doesn't, doesn't recognize it. It's a bit like that, that it tastes a little bit just kind of like it doesn't taste real. There's something mm. wrong with it. There's, There's something, something chemically, yeah. you know, trans fats or whatever they're called. So, 
you will often go to a tapas bar in Spain and they will actually be serving you frozen croquetas. It happens. Really? Yeah. Um, I did a video once with Chicote, this really famous chef here, and he said if it tastes really a lot of, of nutmeg, which these don't actually, then often that means it's a frozen one because they pile wow. on the nutmeg. Right, okay. Okay, we got this guy. Empanadillas de, de atún. So we have two types of empanadillas here because both have tuna in them, but when I bought them, I bought these ones, the small ones, which you'll often get at, at tapas bars. You know, it's like a free tupper at weddings, actually. Get these yeah, weddings. weddings a lot, yeah. And then I was like, no, let me let me upgrade. Let me, let's give them a fair shot. So I got these, these real ones, you know, well, real. real. So, all right, empty. <laughs> mm, the flavor's not bad inside. Mm. Tastes pretty real, right? I mean, more food and it will be good. More um, food in your food. <laughs> not so much air, more food. We don't want air. Not that bad. I mean, um, you know, there's some green pepper in there, like the sofrito they put in it. That is the best thing we've tried so far, mm -hmm. I would say. Mm -hmm. I mean, it looks on the box different from what we're getting here, so. Yeah. Didn't see all that stuff going on, the tuna and the egg, it was more... Yeah, more like a... That Wedding empanadilla. <laughs> Had these at weddings. Will you marry me? Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> it was love at first bite. <laughs> it tastes exactly right, like, mm. you know. For a wedding empanadilla, mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, cheap croquetas. These ones, they look cheap compared to the other guys, which are all like, wow. Just yeah. looking now at the other guys, big chunks of ham in there. Yeah. I never, never saw that ham. Bit into there's it. a lot of, there's a big ham on the package as well. <laughs> Did not see that, that ham in there. These guys, they're not lying. I mean, they look cheap and they are cheap. And so... Maybe they're delicious, we never know. This looks like a communist croqueta, you know? <laughs> Bacalao, salt cod. Actually not bad. I think we're gonna start buying this stuff for the we're house. Gonna, we're gonna start eating frozen food, people. <laughs> Cooking videos are off. Actually better than the expensive one. But what do you think? I think uh, there's some serious flavoring going on. I would oh, say okay, that. so I'm being fooled by the chemicals. I think Probably. so. Probably. Okay, next, calamari. Calamari. Calamari, right. give me one calamari. Like an Aussie. All right, <laughs> calamari. Do we get these? Where do we eat these, Yoli? We eat these in really bad tapas bars. Love it. All right. Yeah. The batter's quite good. <laughs> it's, not, it's, not, it's not terrible. You know, but um, there's no nuance. No it's nuance. Just, it's kind of like soul food. They're just going to please you, but there's never going to be anything interesting there. Like, oh, wow, okay. No, it's just like... I don't think anyone has bought frozen calamaris because they're looking for something interesting. <laughs> okay, bravas. These look very sad. <laughs> I mean, the potatoes were cooked in the microwave. Mm -hmm. Gross, yeah? It's really bad. Really bad. Oh, it's disgusting. I'm not going to eat another one of those. Those are revolting. Take, yeah. Take it away. Don't want to see them. But that does only opening the stuff. Make it hard, man. <laughs> so much for that advanced packaging technology. I can't even open these things. <laughs> so advanced, they're keeping humans out. <laughs> Maybe that's the purpose. Oh, there we go. Very pretty looking. Look at that. It smells of something. <laughs> All right. Not good. Not good news. This. So disgusting, she would not clean the fork with her mouth. It must be wiped on paper. <laughs> Caradilla. Need more technology there. Hard to open, disgusting to eat. Okay. Patatas alioli. What's wrong, what's really wrong is the texture of the potatoes. I was gonna say the texture of the alioli. Uh, for me, the alioli is not so bad. There is a lot of um, acidic acidity going on. Acidic acidity. <laughs> that type of acidity. I'm gonna give these guys low points. I prefer these to the bravas. Oh I'm yeah, sure. totally. But the bravas are like a complete disaster. Yeah. This stuff, it's just the mouth feel is disgusting. I'm talking about mouth feel. Yeah, here. mouth feel. The mouth feel is yeah. horrendous. Mm. Oh, what a meal. Ensalada rusa. Eso. Okay, I opened the stuff and I actually almost vomited. It looks so <laughs> disgusting. <laughs> It looks like a uh, cat food. Totally. I thought right? the exact same thing. It looks like cat food. I didn't want to eat it. Oh my god. Come on, come on. Oh. Brave up. Can we go back to the croquetas? Can we go back to the calamares? <laughs> go for it. 
Oh man, it just <laughs> smells like cat food. Come on. It's disgusting. Mm -hmm. Tastes better than it smells. Oh, okay. You need, need to wash it away. Oh. It's a bit oily, um, but you know, it's not bad in terms of flavor. Oh, okay. okay. Get it away. Yeah. Over there. Over yeah. there. Can't handle it. Next. What's next? Tortilla. Tortilla. Lovingly prepared in the microwave for three mm. minutes. Yay. Uh, and we have Pablo's knife. Pablo's knife. Pablo, to sorry, open. we have to use your knife for this, yeah, 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 yeah. For this act. <laughs> now, a little cultural context here. Often, when people come to your house and they bring food, it's borderline okay, correct me if I'm wrong, Yoli, borderline okay to bring a supermarket tortilla. Yeah, it happens a lot. I just say that it does happen a but lot. But nobody's going to bring, like, frozen croquetas to your house, right? No, or, never. Or this, like, ensaladilla yeah. monstrosity. Yeah, you have to no, never. Those, right? Exactly, yeah. Mm -hmm. mm. It's a standard supermarket tortilla. I've had these before. I would not eat it, but... All right, dessert. Churros. Mm. We have these guys here looking good. Which, by the way, you would never have churros for dessert. Ah, Let's good point. just be clear. Yeah, good right? point, Yoli. Okay. Would you like some sugar on yours? I would like some sugar on mine. One for you, Yoli. Yeah. Would you like sugar on yours? No, thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm gonna dunk mine a little bit of sugar just to give it some life. I'll have them both ways. Oh, I see. Look how quickly the tide turns. Are right, you ready? <laughs> yeah. Taking a bite. Churros. Mm. No, not churros. I mean, Maybe churros. <laughs> it's kind of like fried dough. That's a churro. <laughs> Yeah, I know you're yeah, Spanish I mean, and you're very close to this dish, but it is true. fried dough. <laughs> Hang on, let me have another bite without without sugar. Uh, that's right. Listen to the crack, the crunkle, crunch on, crunkle. Mmm, crunchy. Mm. It is what it is. Mm. So lovely, huh? You enjoying yourself, baby? I'm having a great time. <laughs> it's like a war zone here. <laughs> If you had to pick one tapa yoli that you had to eat again, ah, I may go for the croquetas de bacalao, the hot croquetas. Boom! Communist croquetas <laughs> from yoli. <laughs> Nothing to do with politics. Yeah. How about you? I'm going for the calamari. Ah. I thought the batter was actually pretty good on this. Ah. Listening. Crunchy. Not as crunchy anymore. No. Boom! Well, I'm kind of feeling hungry. Shall we have lunch? Guys, we're going to go and have lunch. If you want to discover real tapas, if you want to find real tapas and real tapas bars, click this playlist over here. It's all about the best tapas bars in Spain. We'll see you over there in the next video in a moment. Hasta ciao. luego. Ciao.